Welcome everybody to the Quick Quack Car Wash groundbreaking event. I'm Mark Crefield, the president and CEO of the Victor Valley Chamber. And I'm so glad all of you are here with us today. We're gonna go ahead and start off the introductions and introduce the founding partner and CMO, Travis Kimball. Travis. Lovely. Thank you. We're so glad to be here. This is uh, incredible. It's kind of obviously a strange, weird, new uh, experience to do a virtual groundbreaking. Um, what's not new, although it should be new for us, is uh, it's, we're also a little late on it. For uh, there's, You'll see as we walk outside, there's more, we've already broken ground. There's almost a building done, but that's okay too, because we wanted to celebrate with, with you. Uh, we wanted to share our excitement for being in Victorville. A little quick history is Quick Quack started uh, in 2004 in Sacramento, and we've been slowly growing over time. And a few years ago, kind of picked up the pace, came down to Southern California, started in Fontana, Moreno Valley, and Hemet, and now we're gonna be in Victorville. We're excited to be here. This will be our first of uh, many locations as we uh, spread out across the Inland Empire in Southern California. So thank you for, for, be, for having us here. Um, next to me is Quackles, our beloved mascot. So we love Quackles. He's the face of our, of our company, and he'll, he also represents what's good about our company is being fast, clean, and loved everywhere. Um, our team member here, Jason Sims Pruitt, is our director of operations, and so he oversees all of the Southern California uh, Inland Empire operations for us. We have store leaders Adrian and Kelly here um, representing uh, what's all great about our team. Um, you can't see, we're all smiling so big. <laughs> That's a trademark of our company, but uh, we're hiding them today a little bit for obvious reasons. But um, we're, we couldn't be more happy to be here in, in Victorville. Um, I was on a call with the, with the chamber um, about a month or so ago, and, and it was really cool to get, be able to see that you guys are a, a really active chamber. And we're an active community partner, so it's a good team. Uh, behind the cameras is Shannon, she's hiding. But she's our marketing person here and she makes this all happen. So we appreciate this opportunity. We're gonna turn the shovel for uh, tradition's sake, and we're just glad to be a part of the chamber, part of the community. We're looking forward to a November opening. We'll have you back for a ribbon cutting and a grand opening that you're gonna really be excited about. Well, outstanding. Well, thank you so much, Travis. And before we do the, the shovel ceremony, I have some uh, representatives and elected uh, rep, uh, to say a few words on behalf of this, uh, uh, ceremonious day. I'd like to first introduce, and you can unmute yourself, uh, the mayor of the city of Victorville. We have Gloria Garcia. Hello, Gloria. Good morning. Good morning, Mark. Good morning, everyone. Can you hear me? Yes, we can hear you loud and clear. Oh, wonderful. Great. Uh, okay. Um, on behalf of the Victorville City Council, congratulations. As you break ground for the first ever quick quack car wash in Victorville and the entire high desert. We are honored to have you and we thank you for your investment in Victorville. It means a great deal to us that you are investing in our community, despite the economic challenges presented by COVID-19. And I look forward to a time when we will be able to celebrate together in person. Quick quack, uh, Quack is not only a successful growing company, but you place a great deal of importance in giving back to our community. You will be a wonderful addition to Victorville and a tremendous corporate citizen for our community. Again, thank you, congratulations, and we wish you great success. Thank you very thank much. You. Thank, you. thank you so thank much. You. Thank you so thank much, you. Mayor Gloria Garcia. And next up, we have representing Congressman Paul Cook's office, we have C.J. Porter. Hello, C.J. Hello. Um, it's good to be here with you today. Um, so first of all, just thank you for allowing us to participate um, in the groundbreaking ceremony, albeit virtually. Um, it's always exciting when a new business comes to the high desert. Uh, my children love going through car washes. We'll have to make, make a note to stop by when you guys open up um, next few months. So on behalf of Congressman Cook, I want to wish you the best, especially in our current business climate. We know it's tough right now. Um, we look forward to seeing you at the grand opening. Thank you. Awesome. Thank, Thank you, you very much. CJ. Next up, we have representing Senator Scott Wilk. We have Rebecca Tennyson. Hello, Rebecca. Have to unmute yourself, Rebecca. 
Okay, uh, my bosses are always trying to keep me on mute, but now I get it. Okay. Good morning, everyone. It's so great to see everyone. And Mark, we really just want to express our thanks to you. Thank you so much for inviting us. And like Quick Quack said, you are a great chamber and you do a great job. And it is our absolute honor to be here today, our very first virtual groundbreaking ceremony. And, um, and we really are looking forward to the actual ribbon cutting ceremony, drive our vehicles through our mobile offices, right through your new car wash. We're so excited. Uh, on behalf of our state Senator Scott Wilk, we would like to express our, our gratitude, um, our commendations of your pushing forward through these crucial times that we're facing and you give uh, hope and strength and, and uh, courage to us all. We, we really admire you and we just wish you blessings of a safe and prosperous project. And um, again, congratulations. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. Outstanding. Well, next up we have representing Assemblyman Jay Obelnolte. We have Christopher Scott. Hello, Chris. Hey, everyone. How's it going? Great. Can you hear me fine? Yes. <laughs> okay, awesome. Well, as Mark mentioned, I'm Christopher Scott with the Office of California State Assemblyman Jay Obernolte. I'm just so, so happy uh, and pleased to be here with you all, even if it's on this end of the screen. I wish I was in person, but hopefully soon enough. Uh, on behalf of the assembly, we just want to say thank you uh, for choosing to do business and operate your business here in our community. And thank you for being an active community partner as well. That's so incredibly important. You know, as you said, the chamber is incredibly active. So just to have that matched by a business such as yours means a lot. So on behalf of Assemblyman Obernolte, thank you. Thank you. And we look forward to uh, many more years of success. Thank you very much. Appreciate All it. All right. And last, and I promise not least at all, we have Don Holland and he's representing our supervisor, Robert Lovingood. Hello, Don. Hey, good morning, Mark. Hey, I just want to uh, give a, a quick uh, a shout out to a quick quack car wash. You know, with all the craziness that's going on and, and all of the stress and pressure that's on the business community, uh, it really takes a lot to go through as an entrepreneur, to go through and push through all of the obstacles and, and go ahead with the, the investment. We just want to thank you on behalf of Supervisor Levengood. Just thank you so much for your investment in our community and, and in San Bernardino County. And we wish you the uh, very best of luck and hope to see you soon at your official ribbon cutting. So thank you very much. Appreciate it. Awesome. Well, thank you, Don, and thank you all, uh, Mayor Garcia and all the other representatives who were on today's call. Well, Travis, I think it's time to, to march on side for the ceremony groundbreaking. Uh, of course, everybody ignore that the building is probably halfway done, but that's okay. <laughs> we're here for a groundbreaking today. So just kind of, you know, pretend that's just a virtual background of what it looks like halfway through the process. So Travis, I'll let you uh, hand the phone back to the uh, videographer and we'll march on outside. Okay, sounds great. Uh, let me say one thing real quick is that we will be asking for your help. Um, we mentioned our community efforts. We will be trying to identify a family or an organization um, to do a fundraiser for. We do a preview fundraiser the day before the ribbon cutting so that on the ribbon cutting day, we can do a check presentation. So um, Shannon will be getting that information out to everyone. But if you come across a family in need or an organization that could really use a boost at this time, um, let us know for sure. So thank you very much. We'll, uh, we'll maybe point the camera at the dirt so you don't see the building. <laughs> <laughs> hey, it's a beautiful building. Thank you. Shovel's all the way, guys. Hi, right, guys. Bear with us for one moment while we get on the road here. I hear shovels. There's shovels. We're moving. Ignore that building in the background. It's just, uh, it's a prop.
You can see all the construction workers, a lot of wonderful work going on out there. And the November will be here before we know it. I think they're looking for some soft dirt. So officially, I guess, after uh, ignoring the building, we're going to break some ground and be official here in Dr. Good in Victorville. So one, two, three, let's go. <laughs> All right. All right. Congratulations. Victorville. See you soon. All right. Thank you, everybody. Thanks for being on the call. Congratulations. Quick quack car wash. We'll see you all soon. Be safe.